Mysterious mustatiles from Saudi Arabia New research they reveal their functions In the northern areas of Saudi Arabia there are huge rectangular structures from 7000 years ago known as mustatiles So far they have been a mystery to scientists because it was not entirely known what function did they have a team of archaeologists has just published recent results excavations of one of these huge buildings, revealing previously unknown evidence indicating that they were used for ritual purposes. Scientists also quit some light on ceremonial customs in ancient Saudi Arabia. They have been discovered in Saudi Arabia since the 1970s monumental stone structures known as mustatiles. However, only in 2017 the year saw the first intensive and systematic study of these enigmatic monuments, although their exact function was not established at that time. Recent excavations in the city of Al Ula showed that these structures were most likely created for purposes ritual and animal sacrifices were made there. Built about 7000 years ago, must atiles are rectangular, low-walled stone structures with a length of 20 to even 600 meters. Mustatal is an Arabic word and means rectangle. About these monuments further we know very little within, although they were first discovered in the 1970s. 20th Century Mysterious Mustatiles may be one of the oldest monumental buildings on world. We currently know over 1,600 of these structures and they are located mainly in northern Saudi Arabia. Currently, mustatiles are partially buried in sand, but they were created when the surroundings looked completely different in these places than in today. At that time, there were even lakes and the current sandy areas grass grew. But what do these areas live in thousands of years ago? People might have needed mustatile? At one such monument, scientists came across an extremely rich collection of animal bones. Bones were also found nearby human, which belonged to a man around the age of 30. Conclusion from discovery it's obvious. The site had to be used for sacrifices. But already previously, it was suspected that these buildings had some ritual significance or cultural. Melissa Kennedy from the University of Western Australia in Perth together with her colleagues, she suggested that the inhabitants of these people at that time certainly did the area has noticed that the climate is starting to change and therefore it is possible that they began to offer sacrifices, e.g. from cattle, to tame the gods. So far, the amount of work there were scientific beliefs about both the mustatils themselves and the beliefs associated with them rather stingy. So far, archaeological works have only been carried out around the 10th century of them. The recently examined mustatil is located approximately 55 kilometers away east of the ancient city of Alula. Its length is 140 meters and it is built of local sandstone. But what could the ritual itself look like? Researchers think that followers of this mysterious cult entered the mistatal on the one hand to go to the second one, the so-called head, where the sacred stone bittle was located, which represented the deity and could be used for communications with him. Around the sacred stone in the examined mistatal was found about 260 fragments of animal bones and horns. Most of them belonged to domestic cattle, although they also found those belonging to goats or gazelles. Archaeologists assume that the animals were brought to the site and then killed. He points to this first everyone has the condition of the found horns. Horns were offered to the gods and the upper parts of the skulls, while the rest of the animal's body in the meantime it may have been eaten by followers during a ritual feast. Accurate determination however, these details are problematic because they could not be found other bones belonging to sacrificed animals. 
However, north of Head Mastatalu, they came across the burial chamber of a man aged 30 or early 40. His analysis the remains showed that he suffered from osteoarthritis. Interestingly though he was buried there 400 years after he was sacrificed in a mastatal mentioned animals. And this is a kind of rule, in the case of burials next to the mustatils, the graves are always later.